everyone welcome to this episode of how to tutorials i am lydia and in this video i'm going to show you how you can isolate your objects in Luna 2.81 and retain your camera framing so let's get started <music> To isolate your object in Blender is as simple as the forward slash button on your keyboard. You can either use the one on the main keyboard or the one with the number pad. They both work for isolation. So to demonstrate this, the first thing to do is select the object. You can either select one or multiple objects. So now the, the cloth is selected, I can select this and isolate the forward slash key to isolate. Then I can select the shoe and isolate it and I can select multiple files, multiple objects and isolate them. So as you can see. But one thing that Blender does by default is that when you isolate, it frames the object. Like now if I isolate this, it frames the object and when you leave the isolate mode, this is the local mode. This is how you know you are in an isolated mode. You see local here. So when you do that, it frames your object. So I really, personally, I don't like this functionality at all. So what I do is that I removed it. In previous version, you couldn't, there was no way to work around this. You just have to use it like that. But in Blender 2.8, they've added the functionality to remove this. So to do that, you have to go to Edit, Preferences, Under Key Map, you punch in the, the forward slash button. So by this, you won't see it. So I'll change it from the name to key binding. So with that, this is what we are looking for. Local view, local view, under the 3D view. So by, by doing this, you can uncheck frame selected, and uncheck frame selected, then save the edit. So now when I isolate, it doesn't frame the object, retain my camera framing. So I can just select anything and isolate it without messing up my framing. So that's it for this video. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe to our channel, click on the notification bell if you've not done so already. And until next time, stay true to your creativity.